Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So we are going to be planning in my new uh, recollections planner for the month of uh, for the month of July and the week of the 17th through the 23rd. And I apologize, I thought I was recording already and I wasn't. So the only thing that you've missed is I put down my bottom strips of uh, washi tape and it doesn't quite fit all the way over and I think that's my fault because when I ordered this kit I actually ordered it for a happy planner and this is an Erin Condren planner so the happy planner is shorter across the bottom so I'm just gonna go with it so now I'm gonna put my Monday headers on here Monday Tuesday Wednesday and I think it will completely cover, maybe it won't, yeah, it's not going to completely cover, so we'll have to think of something creative to do there, and in the meantime, I can put my, um, my today's, I'm going to put my today's across the top. I like to do that um, just because that's kind of the style that I go for. So, I don't mind having um, some blank space. I know some people don't like to have white space. I really don't mind it as long as I can see uh, everything that I need to do. And I have, I like to do some decorating, but it doesn't bother me to have white space. So, I'm going to just do those across the top there. And... I'm going to do my little checklist. These might be a little bit... I think I got that first one a little bit crooked, so I'm trying to use these lines here to make it be more straight. I do, I'm going to take this one up and fix it. This paper is, um, nope, all right, it's going to stay there. We're not going to mess with that, and that's okay. I can, I can work with it, I can work with it. This paper is not as thick as the Happy Planner paper is, so you have to be kind of sure where you want it to go before you put it down. I have noticed that, and I've ha heard a couple people um, saying that that was something that was uh, a concern for them, is that the paper wasn't. Um, I don't mind because, again, this is something that I am going to save, yes, but it's also, um, it's also a fun craft for me. So does it have to last the rest of my life? No, it really doesn't. Um, there are some really pretty little, um, like, page, I don't know what you call those, but page banners. So I'm going to use some of those here as well as I go into this second portion. I'm even going to cover up that bottom little banner there just so it can kind of overlap. Make sure I'm getting them straight. I am a beginner when it comes to this planning. I've been doing it for about a year. And uh, even though that seems like a long time, in the planner world, it's really not. So I do still struggle with getting things straight. So if you have a technique that you like to share with the rest of us here about how to get things straight or um, what you like to do going forward, you know what? I have one little piece of paper that I want to grab, so I'm going to go off camera for one second uh, while I do that, and I'll be right back. I just went and grabbed my work schedule because I have a little piece of paper. Um, it just kind of shows like my work schedule and what's going on throughout the week. So I'm going to put that off to the side here and just glance down to it. So on Monday, I'm going to put a work flag 
And I think I'm gonna use these pretty little guys as my work flags to mark like the time uh, that at the time or to so I can flip through and know that that is a work day. And I have one also on Wednesday. I'm gonna put a pink one there on Wednesday. I um, am working part-time as a makeup artist and I'm also freelancing in the uh, Fort Myers area. So now I'm going to move over here and put that pretty bloom where you planted. And I think I do want to cover, so I'm going to put a little bit of this gold wasi. And I think I'm just going to cover that because I know it's July. Um, so I'm going to cover that little rip right there. And I'm going to put this pretty bloom where you're planted sticker right over top right there and then I'm going to um, just kind of fill in along the bottom here with some other decorative stickers This is going to be a relatively simple week as far as planning goes because I am going to be working, but I'm also uh, I'm also going to be doing some um, freelance work and whatnot. So I can't put a lot of that detail in here. And like when it comes to like TV shows and stuff like that. I don't write those down so much, so I'm going to save this pretty little unicorn for the next page. Maybe I'll use this little striped flowers. I love the quality of Lavin Forest um, stickers. They're absolutely beautiful. So now I'm going to work on this over here. So I'm going to say appointments. I do have a couple of appointments. Uh, this week. So I'm going to put those here. And I'm going to put a checkbox. And I'm going to just fill in that space by using one of these little half boxes here. Just be sure of your placement. Come on, little buddy. There we go. Be sure of your placement. And then, as far as any a, a little additionals, there are these cute little um, flags here. And there's these cute little hearts. So, let's see, have we got a money sign? I don't have a money sign. Oh yeah, I do, payday right here. So my payday is on Thursday, so that'll go on the next page over. I'm just trying to think of what else I can put here. And I think I'm gonna actually put, there's a really pretty little water tracker here. And I think I'm gonna put that right here above the bloom where you're planted. And I'm gonna, don't mind it if it goes over a little bit. That's fine with me. It will just help to fill in that pretty space. I'm happy with how that looks. So I'm gonna flip over and do the other side now. And then we can come back and fill in with the actual pen. So I'm just gonna flip over to the other side. Again, all I did was put this pretty little wasi down. So I'm gonna start with the, um, the today headers. And put those across and I think I do have a weekend banner yes I do so I'm gonna start with my today's so one of the things that's going on in my life is I am uh, a working makeup artist I work for an organic skincare company called origins 
and I love to do videos, so if you would like to see my daily skincare routine, just comment down below and I'll make a video for that. But I, um, I also post on Instagram almost daily. I post on, um, I post on Facebook. And so I'll link, leave those links down below. I'm going to use this now that I have that sticker up there. I'm just going to butt it up against there and see if that will help to get it straight. Ish, straight, straighter. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. That one kind of went a little off. One of the things that I did like about having the Happy Planner is that uh, versus this coil is that the Happy Planner you can take the pages right out and put them on a flat surface. So I can see why some people would say yes that they struggle with getting things straight in these planners because you kind of have to struggle with that coil but it is doable just take your time and it it really doesn't have to be perfect um, at least for me I'm I'm the farthest thing from a perfectionist so as long as it's in there and it's usable and accessible then that's good enough for me I try to get it really good and straight and we'll just do the best that we can with what we have. So next week, um, starting, uh, starting on Monday, next week is gonna be really exciting. We are doing vacation Bible school at our church, and that is just a fun time for kids that are ages kindergarten through fifth grade to come and learn about the Lord and it's just a really I just I'm waiting for it to um, to be here so I can enjoy that so I'm just looking for those little flags I think I'm going to use these um, two more here and then we'll choose maybe maybe those here because they go with the bottom as well I'm going to try to get a little straighter here if I can. So have any of you done any traveling this month? I just came back from Orlando in June and that was really nice. And then in August I'm going to be traveling for Origins training in Miami. So let me look over here for my days on the far side of the week. I have uh, Thursday and Friday. So I'm going to do a blue and a pink. I left off with pink. So Thursday you're going to be blue. And Friday you are going to be pink. I absolutely love her stickers. The quality of her stickers are beautiful. Um, I'm going to put this weekend banner up now. And I don't mind if it overlaps. That's fine with me. Let me put that little weekend banner up. Very pretty. Uh, see any other colors that we have here. I have this beautiful one here. I think I'm going to put it over the weekend. And I think I'm going to put it over the weekend like this. I'm going to tip him up though like that. And just run some of this wasi along that little pink line there. And I like my wasu tape to be organic looking, so I never worry about getting it perfectly straight. I like that it's organic looking, so um, that's just me. That's just a personal thing. Um, I might put a little bit of this pink in there as well. Ooh, 
shoot, I can't find the end of this one. There he is. And it does. When you put that little bit of washi tape on there, it comes up a little easier so that you can do your layering. So I am. I'm just going to lay those like that and give it a little tear. I like that. Pretty. I just, her stickers are fantastic. If you haven't checked her out, check her out. So I'm going to put these little half boxes here. And these are just things like um, the days that I have to work. I can do appointments or things like that. I just love these um, these weekend stickers. So for Thursday and Friday, I know that those days are going to be really um, quite busy. So I'm going to put that little hashtag busy girl on there. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to put a reminder that on Thursday is a pay period. So I can put that there. And then I'm pretty happy with how that looks. I'm going to switch over to my other planner now, which we will just move out of the way. This is the little mini planner, the Hooray for Today mini. We find my spot here, which is the July marker. So this is, will be Monday through Sunday. And I'm just going to lay down some decorative um, elements as well. And I'm going to make it the same type of uh, spread. So I have some really pretty little leftover tapes. So I still want to be able to write in each one of the days. So I'm just leaving some big spaces here. And I actually might use the Monday through Friday cover-ups in this spread simply because I think it might work. I got a little straggler there. There it goes. So it's all about using it and being creative. And there is no right and wrong with your planner. If your planner works for you and what you need it to do, then it's working. And if it's not working, find out why it's not working and simply change that to meet your, to meet your needs. Um, if you need it to accommodate you in some other different way, then simply find a way to make that work for you. So the only person that ever really sees your planner is yourself or whoever you're sharing it with. And in my case, it's my, my planner community. So you guys completely understand. So just make it work for you. So I like those little stickers there in varying places. And I'm just going to go back in now. I'm going to put these date covers and I am going to use them here in this planner because I think I can use them and, and put the date right on it. And it's actually a little bit easier to maneuver with, um, with these stickers as we go through because it has a little, little guideline there and it just, I don't know why, it just, it's seeming to um, line up a little easier with this planner and it might just be like the coil placement. So we're just going to make it work. <laughs> There is, um, with her five page spread, there is so many stickers and so many different options that I feel like you do have enough stickers. And I, I'm definitely gonna have enough stickers to do um, the two spreads and these planners. So I'm really happy with that. Um, I like to 
have my two spreads match each other as I go through the week. So this is really nice that there's plenty of stickers to spread out. And, and like I said, I don't mind the white space because I like to have that, um, that little bit of room to write things down. So I'm enjoying that. That looks really nice. Um, so I'm gonna actually use these little flags here to indicate, again, the days of the week that I'm working. So Monday will be a work day for me. And Wednesday will be a work day. And then Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So Thursday and Friday. And these little flags are absolutely beautiful. They're just the prettiest pattern. I just, oh, they're beautiful. Latin Forest is her shop name. I'm gonna come close with it so you can see. They are absolutely beautiful. Check Vicki's channel out. I just, I just can't say enough of how, how beautiful they are. So I have those, I have those appointment flags down. Um, I am going to do these little stickers that say to do because I can use those for every day at work. And even when I'm not at work, I do have some phone calls to make this week. So that's kind of important. I'm going to put one here on Tuesday to do. Just really a beautiful kit. Tell me some of the people that you like to use their kits because I'm always looking for someone else to try out. Um, I have tried a couple of other shops before in the past. Uh, a couple of them I didn't really care for, but for Lab and Forest, every single one of her kits, absolutely beautiful. And um, so that's the to-dos. Now I think, I don't want it to get too busy because this is a smaller planner. So I think what I'm gonna do is take some of these smaller decorative elements and I'm gonna use this pretty little unicorn here to tie in. And I'm gonna put him right here. And I'm going to put this little sticker that says note to self. And I'm going to put this right across where it says notes here. And I'm happy with that. Honestly, I really am, guys. So um, the one thing that I can think of is that I want to put a little money sticker. A little money sticker on Thursday. Thursday is my payday. And I still have a couple of stickers left over, believe it or not. So I have out of the, let's see, one, two, this is what I ended up using up out of the kit. I have one empty, I have two empties. Um, I have this one that still has a couple little um, sheets on it still. I have some little things. Um, and a couple of extra stickers, so I'm just going to put those in my extra sticker kit. You guys know that I just use those all the time. So I can actually, I can put one more little sticker here, which is this little trash can for recycling day on Monday. And then on Thursday, I'm going to put this little car because my car desperately need the car wash. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you again next Sunday, and I hope you have a wonderful, successful week, because when you're successful planning, that's planning for success. See you next time.